Hello there guys, it's a Purpose Ad here and welcome to the third episode of our Let's Play Stronghold Warlords. And we're here in the final mission of the Jungle Kingdoms of Thuk Pan. I have been betrayed and now stand exposed. But we'll fight to the last before giving this land to invaders. Right there, I know we're kind of far away, we don't have many peasants. Not enough workers available to run this building. But we need. We could be doing a lot of. kind of. and houses. There, yeah, that's us got enough seats. Right, let's see, oh, the warriors. Sure. So over here, and while this is happening, let's. To all enclosed it as this land is too uneven to build. As I was running out of stone. Right, we've got a stone mine there, but we're probably still getting our buffalo tamer. A tether, I should say. And that's two to keep transporting it. Weapons needed, Highness. Have we got folk making things? Yes, two there and two there. Right, that's fine. Two and two is okay. I'm going to keep the population the way it is. And maybe I'll. So let's see. Right, it's not letting me see the main map. The warlord map, sorry. So we. Chufa. Jungle. Jian Shi Dai Fa. Right, actually. I've only got a couple of stairs in there. I need stairs here, which means I need to wait on the stone coming. Which is fine. So I can get a couple round at the corners there. Woman drawn to Yang Hall. Gong Jen Show, Xing Dong. Gong Jen Show, Chu Xu. Woman drawn to Yang Hall. Woman Jun Bei Chu Xu. Gong Jen Show, Xing Xing. Woman Shiro Mabala. Let's just get a lot of spears. So, eh, you have a phone for Gong Show, Xing Dong. So, eh, you heard you. Bess, he. Right, so we're doing fine, how's our... Right, we're doing okay, we're doing okay. I can probably... Do that there. Keeps them happy then out. Peasants needed, Highness. Yeah. And I want the gold to come in nice and quickly, so that I can just keep flinging out spearmen. Because if that's what it takes, an extra couple of spear units to survive the siege, then that's what it takes. We've got plenty of wood there, it's just the, the travelling time. And as I've got a stone. Okay. 
有新指令吗？弓箭手，出发，快上城墙！领主，弓箭手先行，后备军就绪。快上城墙！来，有新指令吗 ？Set up to send the other guy better bonus to range. 我们准备就绪，遵命。我们状态良好，出发。Toàn bộ lạc đứng lên. Một cuộc săn đuổi, ngài có chắc không? Đôi chân của chúng tôi đang di chuyển. Sao vậy? Chúng ta chuyển sang mã bắt rồi. Peasants needed, Highness. So we've got four days and four hours. 又要打仗吗 ？Let's just get some arms on the walls. 军，队长，小卫，我们马上出发。小卫，快上城墙！How are they getting on their walls? Well, they're getting on there now, but... I'm dogs of the enemy fire in a radius. Yeah, so I should keep them safe. This must be built next to an existing wall. The forces of Nanyue are nearly here. How kind of you to keep me here by your side, fighting to the end. <laughs> quite a quite a cheeky advisor we've got there. You want to fight, Master? Lord. 快上城墙！段伯兰，兵人，请坐。有何指令 ？This is like an action. It's seventy spears. 又要打仗吗 ？Twenty-nine axes. That's fine. Recruits needed, Highness. So what's that going to do? Is that going to make my spears up to about a hundred? Một ngày tuyệt vời để chiến đấu. Dừng. Ninety-four to be precise. Một ngày tuyệt vời để chiến đấu. Chúng ta nên đi đâu? Chúng tôi lên đường. Tôi đã sẵn sàng. Nếu vậy, số một hundred này. Some more rice fields, just keep the food coming in. Especially because, like, so, like, so a minute, especially when we've got, like, so a proper siege happening by the sounds of it. So, why do you just go in the middle there? Just but over there, I don't have as many towers there. Do you have a new order? Recruits needed, Highness. So, 20 seconds. Right, so I've got the guts of 120 spears. 115. Ngài có chắc không? Lần theo đường đi. 
A message from Thuk Fan. Their numbers are vast, but Kao Loa will not fall. The forces of Jiao Tuo will break upon us like water on a rock. Good darts are firing, so let's charge. That's a nice sight to see my 115 spears charging. Perfect. Recruits needed, Highness. Can I know about an air barracks would be quite handy. Then that would mean I would have one. But let's just sit and that. Then I've got one purely for archers and the axemen, one purely for like my spear tribesmen. Which I have 132 of now, so if they survive the enemy invasions for 15 minutes. Here's some chronic talk. I've got two tables here that should start firing soon. Perfect. Perfect. Weapons needed, Highness. Peasants needed, Highness. Where are we going? Quite a came from both of them, but so now. Then, we'll go there. I'm still going to keep some guys at the side here because I don't know if that. What was that? Does that mean they come, they come that area? The Nenue are attacking yeah. again, and they've brought powerful siege weapons to aid their assault. Where? A message from Thuk Fan. Hold fast! No machine can penetrate the walls of Koloa! Perfect. With these towers here, I've got it covered. And yes, okay, I've got a few archers and towers here. They're just there to back ups. How's our vegetables doing? Our vegetables are doing brilliant. So is our rice, and so is our money. Recruits needed, Highness. Oh, I'm going to about 160 spears. I've got, I've got 40 archers and just over 30 archers. Is it 32, I believe? 38 now. Oh well. 160 of these dudes. There's 200 basically between them and the axes. So you're talking about the guts of 240. I want to be an opera singer when I grow up. So still get the majority of the time left. Their numbers are endless, Your Highness. How can we repel this army? It is a catapult. As soon as the archers start firing, we'll charge in with the archer support. Okay. Oi, oi, oi. You are the drama. We are under attack. No. Attack the catapult. And hope I can get it before it actually gets a volley off. Ooh. I'm not all dead, am I? Actually, then I do too much damage. I'm surprised. And back to the middle. We seem to have it kind of covered. Oh, bountiful harvest achievement progress. I'm presuming that's collect 100,000 food. 
which I'm halfway there. Ah, I never even noticed them. So, eh, there we go. So, okay, yes, these guys are maybe not the most elite in the world. It's the numbers. Yeah, make sure they don't get to destroy any of my rice fields. Peasants needed, Highness. Here's me gonna have what, over two hundred. I think that's a fair army. Oh, there's some coming behind. And three. Axemen coming here, but you're just going to get slaughtered by the archers. To be fair, they get slaughtered by the archers as well. Now let's keep the axemen there and let's split his spear into two groups one and 97. And this one's 111. And if I take these guys and add them to 97, that'll make that what 118. Right, you four archers, me got there five, so if I put you four there on that tower, you three oh, don't seem to be needed right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Showing it three will go there. In fact, where'd they go? One. We can go there to finish that off. There we go. So that's one, two, three tables full of net four. Nines, which is 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So 48 answers, I do believe. Tung There's a rocket thing and a catapult coming now. Oh wait, is it only they guys that have flags? We don't spears don't have flags. Ah Let's George. So I've lost what? See, so yeah, I've lost a few here, but that's fine. We've lost nineteen there. So what, we've got about five minutes left to survive, I think. 
making her getting bigger and more repetitive and coming in more directions. How's the Axeman doing? If they've got the Archer support, that's perfect. Hello, Your Highness. Thought I'd kill them out. Ninety two, we're down to. Yeah, we've got another tower. Highness, scouts report a vast final wave is coming, overwhelming in size and strength. So our final wave is coming. We've got about three minutes left, so that does sound about right. So I did some more stairs round about. A message from Thuk Fan. I see now. Nothing will hold back this horde. All hope is lost. My dream is over. Preparations are being made for Thuk Fan to escape the fortress, Highness. Now it is up to you to make a final stand. Do not let our enemy reach the keep, and we might at least give our leader the chance to escape. <laughs> Uh, look, uh, look at the archers just absolutely raining up on them. And over here they're getting people down. I need some archers for there. I've only got four bows. Weapons needed, Highness. So is this the final wave, I take it? Because they said there was a vast final wave approaching. Which if there was... And that's that. We've still got oh, but, eh, just under 200 spears. We've got the guts of probably 80 archers. So, uh, and just over 50... Axeman. I've well, we got plenty of wood, let's just give some guys like, a job for when the siege is over. My guys can have rice coming at their lugs. Yeah. Can I say I don't look after my people? We need more houses. What is that? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. About 20 rice farms I just put in. I wonder what's the most rushes you can give. 5 times the rations. Which rice will go down massively just now, but then it would went up. But look at the time; there's not enough time back to to proper see it all. But it, the rice would have tripled probably because that's only been about ten, eleven. So I did twenty, so that would triple the production, which will 
Make it to about 420 daily. But there we have victory. So we killed 228 and we only lost 63. So we completed the Jungle Kingdom's campaign. His warriors fought bravely, even as they were steadily overwhelmed by the onslaught. Those who had stood by the king since his earliest days would not believe he could abandon them at the final moment. But eventually, the castle was taken. The king of Olak was gone, and Zhao Tuo had conquered the kingdom he fought so many years to take. See, I was doing well while I was in charge. The economic campaign. I've never done this one, so maybe... Or do we leave that to the end and just keep doing the, the other campaigns? Yeah, why not? So, we will go to the warring states of China with the Qing Shi Huang. Zheng, the ruler of the Qing state, state, faces insurrection from a conspirator. Zheng's rulership over Qing has not been a smooth one. In his youth, suspicions grew over Zheng's parentage and right to the throne. After the death of his father, Zheng became king at the age of 13. <laughs> Meanwhile, his mother took on a new partner, Lao Ai, and had two more children in secret. Emboldened by the prospect of his son replacing Zheng on the throne, Lao Ai has now gathered an army at the capital, Yong, and staged a coup. Now Zheng must stamp out this rebellion once and for all. So build your economy with your new resources, capture the warlords on the map, storm the castle and kill Lao Ai, and protect the Lord at all costs. That's... It's fairly fortified. A message from Qin Shi Huang. No amount of walls will protect you from my wrath, Lao Ai. You will rue the day you defied me. Right, so we've got the tiger, the ox, the mouse. Only way there's this little river here. What's the tiger? Military support. We now have access to tea farms, Your Highness. Always a great source of happiness. To serve tea to our people, we need tea plantations to grow the tea and a tea house to serve it. Right, so what we to do about the tea plantation? And the tea house, but let's get some more. Now we are ready to start collecting iron. Iron can be gathered by iron mines on iron deposits and is stored in the stockpile. By collecting iron, we can craft more advanced weapons for powerful units. The right. warlords in this region excel at launching attacks, Your Highness. We can use them to aid our assault on Lao Ai. Each warlord has an influence meter. By spending diplomacy points, you can increase your influence over them. Once you have passed the critical threshold, the warlord will join your side willingly. There is more than one way to bring a warlord to your side, Highness. Through diplomatic means, you can convince them to join you without resorting to arms. I shouldn't have built that because I need an armory. Which I also need wood for. Oh yeah, I do have some wood, it's okay. So we have to capture two warlords, so let's see what we've got up here. Archers. I've got enough stone perfect because I forgot to make some steels. 
快上城墙。So the two warlords are being captured. Is this one? And this one, I presume. Oh, oh, they're firing. And so are they. 振作精神。These guys are heavily armored. 长官，有何吩咐？我们马上出发。Tribesmen now. I'm gonna have to kind of get his ring over, I think. That's what I can do. Too close to the enemy. Apparently not. Yeah, so I need to wait for the armory. So I've not built this one perfectly. The Lord is being attacked. Never used my lord in hand-to-hand -hand combat before. I don't think I've, I've never had to. Let's just get rid of this tower once she's out. Too close to the enemy. Never even noticed him there. Right, you go back then. We'll see if you can heal. How we do that and get an armory. I'll see that stuff get big defenses two, three. Weapons needed, Highness. Gong Jin Shou Jiu Xu. Yeah. I serve. Oh, well, the loose bars went up because my lord's taking damage. Lingzhu, you have a new order? Lingzhu, you can't do it. Yeah. Gong Jian Shou, let's go! I'm guessing he ain't healing. Oh, well, at least that's something I know now. We're in good condition. So I kind of messed up a bit, basically wasted a lot of stone. 
And we'll kill these archers on the tower and then that'll be us. Maybe. So we need to fight this dude. Have you orders, ma? We will fight again. Have new plans? Yes, General. 我 kill this archer， and then it's free range into the lord。首领，没问题，长官。Perfect。So guys, thank you very, very much for watching this is Power Prasad out to the loo the new.